So this is our MSI QBN. Just like here, we call it QBN. And the CPU is the Braswell Celeron or Pentium. And it supports MSATA SSD and 2.5 inch hard disk. Because we have two base. Actually, we have two, two different types. One is this, one is a little big. It's a support a 2.5 inch hard disk. And the other one is the smaller, more slim, just like here, is MSATA. Okay. And here you can see we have HDMI, we have the VGA, and we have the two USB 3.0. And that's for the internet, of course. And this side, we have two USB 3.0. So actually, we have three. Total, we have three USB ports. Okay. And one thing important is, it's fanless. So you, you will not hear anything. It's very quiet. So, and don't worry about the thermal. We have very good design for it. Okay. And the size is only around 10 centimeters. It's a little bit little, uh, smaller than Intel Nuke. And the second one about this. This is the QB2 Plus. We call it a QB2 Plus. And this CPU is a desktop CPU. So you could support to the Core i up to Core i7, whatever you need. And chipset is H110 or Q170. And the Q170 support VPro. VPro, this function from Intel. And about the ports, we have two USB, and here is, so total three USB 2.0. And one is Type-C, Type-C, USB 3.1 Gen 1. And here is the card reader, okay? And that's for the headset. And here you could see we have the two USB 3.0 and HDMI and display port. And here, HDMI out. So totally, we support three, three monitor with the Q170 chipset. And this one is the COM port. So it's very good for the commercial user. Yep. And here we have a, a little design and very good for the end user. We have a USB port here. And it also supports the supercharger function. That means you don't need to turn on the machine. You could charge your cell phone, your MP3 player, or whatever devices. Okay. And this one is Pro 16 Flex. Because we call it Flex because we have the auto rotation function. Just like your cell phone. We have you could do this or do this. Yep. You could see it, it works very smoothly because the CPU is quad core. Even it's Celeron, but it's quad core. And it looks like a big tablet. Yes, it could be. Because we have battery inside and it, it could work around two hours with a full, load, full loading. And for the back, for the I.O. side, you could see, let me take this out. You could see we have, actually here are three RJ42, but these two, sorry, RJ45, this two is for the COM port. It's, so it could be a POS machine. And this one is for the internet. This is a regular RJ45, okay? And for here, USB, we have two USB 3.0 here. And we have a card reader, and here is HDMI. So if you think this monitor is a little smaller, you still could change to a bigger monitor. Okay. Yep. And this one is with a 10-point touch. So it's very convenient for some family, for kids, for the kitchen. And the most important thing, we have the mesa, we have VESA mount. 
so you could mount it on the kitchen or living room or you could just put it in your your room yeah.